It's been um, five years since we sat here. You had your third wheel, Mark Ruffalo, just here reaching across to hug you guys when That's we right. sat down last oh, time. Just... But the love story, this love story. This is a love story, yeah. Yeah. This yeah. Is a love story. yeah. Was it a love at first sight love story, you two? Well, I think so. It was, yeah. yeah. I actually, uh, I saw a boy, his beautiful film, many years ago, called my agent and said, oh, can I meet up with him? We then had a coffee, and it was kind of the first time I'd done that. It was like a blind date of sorts. <laughs> And then I said, oh, sorry, this is a bit awkward. I've never done this before. And he said, I've never done this either. Yeah. And uh, then we became mates. Yeah, we became mates. And, like, you know, I'd, I'd take my kids over to his place and we sort of hang out. So, yeah. And never really talked about work at all. And then, then Ragnarok came about. And then uh, we talked and was like, well, let's not tell them we're friends. Because you know, I, I want to see if I can get this job just based on, like, you know, let's having let good it be ideas. Their idea. Yeah. And, and, and um, on, yeah. yeah. And then it happened. And, uh, and, <clears throat> And, you know, with this film, like, you know, on Ragnarok, we just, I mean, I guess we fell more in love. We just, like, you know, we, we managed that we, <laughs> that, that we managed to find out that we, I don't know why I did that. That's a really <laughs> odd thing when I was talking about we fell in love. <laughs> That's <laughs> not quite, it was, that was more a meeting of minds, <laughs> not a meeting of other stuff, okay? That's not what I'm, I'm That's not the talking. Asgardian High One. That's, That's Asgardian High One. <laughs> one. <laughs> the Asgardian Erect One. <laughs> um... <laughs> All unusable. Oh, so, um, so <laughs> and action. So, no, we uh, <laughs> we found that um, we shared a connection. Yeah, yeah connection. Yeah, connection. A connection. Two brains. Our brains just worked. <laughs> Somehow it all worked. And then we, um, you know, we just like yeah, understood each other a lot on Ragnarok. We put everything that we had into. We Ragnarok. kind of had nothing to lose in Ragnarok yeah. either. I mean, I don't think they were even going to make a, th a Thor three, and said, "All right, let's give them one more go," and uh, and we gave it a go and kind of broke the mold, did something different, reinvented yeah. it, and thinking yes. they probably won't ever make another one. Yeah, of and these. then they said, "Come back and do it again," and we thought, "Oh, uh -oh no, we, we, we used all the ideas up. And we we, we had so nothing how left." How did that work then? So did you well, go now we're good. have a meeting of the minds to make? We met up again. And, no, uh, we just got our penises together. <laughs> um, <laughs> So, no, we, um, we um, <laughs> what? It's about normalising it. It's Great. about normalising that kind of Great. stuff between two friends. Hey, the Greeks started it. Yeah. Okay? The Greeks started it. Yeah. And now they're like, no, we know we did it. Yeah. Um, you know, they're like, they're like oh, Zeus. two best friends get to just, go, just like, just hang out and just do, do whatever they want. It's not gay. Um... But it's not it gay was, if you're best friends. You know, um, so, you know, so we got together and we were like, well, with this one, it was like, what's something that's going to be that you would least expect from a Thor film, right? And it's yeah. like, Thor dealing with love. love. Thor dealing with the midlife crisis yeah. and trying to find his purpose in life. Mm. His porpoise. <laughs> and his porpoise. he finds him. It's space dolphins. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but, but, you know... <laughs> <laughs> What's your porpoise? <laughs> uh, sorry, babe, this has gone right, off the rails, right, but this right. is probably the, being the best interview you've ever had. the best done. interview we've ever Can we talk about love just for a second? Mm. We just did. Okay. <laughs> um, because uh, the world feels a little bit shit, and there was something about walking out of that film where I thought, the kids are going to save us. It's the kind of film I feel like we really needed to sit in for a couple of hours this morning. Do you feel that too? Absolutely. Yeah. yeah. It is. It's a celebration, actually, yeah. of love. And all the different types of love. Yeah. And, you know, what love means is a slight misdirect. I'm not going to spoil anything with the title, you know. It's like mm -hmm. where what people think is the, the love in the film might not be the love in the film. Mm -hmm. And he does find his purpose in the, um, in the end of the film. And it's... It, 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 you know, obviously, the last two years have been very hard, and it's we've been. I'm really proud of the fact that we made a film that is uplifting and empowering yeah. for, you know, on many fronts for like women and for the queer community as well. And mm. it's like it's kind of making people feel seen, and to do it with a massive mainstream movie where more more audiences than anywhere else are going to mm. see this than a small tiny film about the queer community. Mm. You know, this helps to normalise it and to, you know, to make mm. it feel like it's just, you know, it's just part of us and who we are. And mm -hmm. that's, 
Really it's awesome. Been, it, it, one of Tiger's many, many tricks and talents is to, even in the smaller films he's done, largely entertaining and funny, but underneath it, whether you're aware of it or not, there is a deep message and a beautiful message and, and one of inclusion and celebration on, on every level. Um, and, and I think it's wonderful and I feel very thankful to be a part of it, but it's, it's, uh, you guys are doing mad, I'm getting mad. Wrap it up. Oh, we're not sure, but there's a lot of fingering going on. Oh, what? Whoa! Oh, disgusting! You took it there, Kate.